Hello and welcome to another Somerset Real Ale review. Um, I have with me now from the Red Rock Brewery in uh, Timber, Devon, their Capstan. What a fantastic beer this looks like. I've never had it before. Um, but the other beers that I've had from this brewery have been absolutely solid. So I'm really looking forward to this. It's in a brown 500ml uh, bottle. It's a 5.8% ABV. Red cap on the top there. It's bottle conditioned. Lovely picture on the front there of a cat stand on uh, some sort of uh, harbour. I don't know where that would be. Uh, it says a full strength, robust ale. Um, it's uh, yeah, I'm look, really looking forward to this. Right, let's pop it open. Nothing much on the opening there. Well, to be honest, I was looking where the cap went, and there may have been a bit of smoke. Right, here we go. Oh yeah, that's coming out lovely, lovely pour. No, um, no head on that at all. Absolutely nothing. There's a few bubbles floating on the surface, but nothing, uh, nothing else. Um, it's kind of a dark coppery, sort of browny, light brownish colour. Um, it is a little bit darker than you can see. That's, that's about yeah, the light shining through it too much. That's about it there. That colour there. That's about it. If you look through there, that's. Oh yeah, it's a bit yeah, it's a bit lighter than the light. That looks too light there. Um, yeah. So um, we've got no carbonation in it whatsoever. Let's get the nose. That's really malty. Really malty. Yeah, give it a stir up this a bit. Hmm. <laughs> it does smell a bit drainy. Um hmm, kind of hmm. I don't know if anyone's got kids, but it kind of reminds you <laughs> of the smell of nappy bags or diaper bags if you're washing washing in the states. <laughs> I'm not sure about the smell of that to be honest. I mean you do get a bit of you do get the hoppy sort of smell but I can't get over that sort of stale nappy sort of smell. Hmm. Well then <laughs> Let's dig in and see what happens. If I, uh, <laughs> I might, uh, I might be sick if it tastes like it smells, but let's hope not. Eh? Yeah, that that actually tastes all right to be honest. Don't worry, I'm not <laughs> sick of anything. Um. Yeah, I mean you get an initially a sort of sweet, um, sweet taste from the from the malts, um, slight bitterness, and a, and a sort of a floral sort of taste. Um, yeah, that's not that's not a bad flavour actually. I just can't get over that smell. It's like a fausty sort of, you know.
Um, no carbonation in there at all. I would describe that as very pleasant. Um, yeah, it's it's not it's not bad. It's not bad. I mean, it's not. The trouble is that the smell sort of because the smell is all part of it um, for me and I'm sure many others. Um, your aromas really sort of set you up for what you what you're going to drink, and and sometimes it is your aroma is completely different to what the flavour is. Um, you know, you could get a really good aroma off of a beer, and sometimes you take your first sip and you think that it's just nothing like it. it, it, it it's like the rug is sort of pulled from under your feet. You know, you've built up to this fantastic flavour, um, and and you take a sip, and that's it. There's nothing there. Whereas this is very much the other way. Um, the smell is. I wouldn't go as far as to say it's skunky. It's, it's not. It's not skunky because the beer isn't off. But it doesn't smell very appealing. But you take your first mouthful, and it's actually a very pleasant ale. Yeah, very smooth, very smooth on the mouth. Very smooth indeed. Um, well, about this sort of time, I normally throw in the um, the sediment and see if it makes any difference. Um, normally they say not to throw in the sediment and leave it in the bottle, but I personally like it. It's all down to personal choice. Well, me, so I'm gonna give it a good swill around and chuck it on in there. Yeah, oh, that's made it nice and cloudy. Still, absolutely no head whatsoever. Um, the bottle's completely empty. Um, I'm actually gonna leave that for a bit and. Um, Read you the uh, read you the bottle a minute. Uh, contains spring water, malted barley, hops, and yeast. <coughs> uh, 500 ml, 5.8% 5, 5 traditional real ale. Capstan, a full strength Rubest ale from the Red Rock Brewery. Uh, Red Rock Brewery, Capstan, full strength Rubest ale. Strong, satisfying, malty beer with a good hop balance. Uh, our family run microbrewery. Is based in a renovated barn on, barn on a sleepy farm in South Devon. Uh, using the finest natural ingredients and pure spring water, we are able to produce distinctly different handmade Devonshire ales. This beer is naturally conditioned in the bottle. To enjoy it at its best, chill for 30 minutes and pour carefully into a glass without stirring the live yeast sediment. Uh, website is www.redrockbrewery.co.uk telephone 01626879738 um, yeah I mean see one thing about about these beers that I've noticed from the Red Rock you you I mean it, it mentions there that you can that it's brewed with um, spring water well, you can definitely taste that it, it's so pure such a pure the water in there is so pure Anyway, let's um, let's have a try it with this uh, with this element in. Yeah, I'm still getting that. Perhaps it's like like more damp, yeasty sort of smell. Anyway, let's get give it a taste. And there's no difference in that whatsoever. You wouldn't even know I pulled the yeast in there, to be honest. But that that that's that's a decent beer. That is a decent beer. That um, I'm going to give that I'm, purely because of the smell. I'm going to give it a seven out of ten. If that smell hadn't have been there, I think I perhaps would have given it a bit higher, but um, all in all, it's a good beer that, worth trying. Uh, thanks for watching, um, 
If you want to get in contact with me, email uh, somersetrealairreviews at gmail.com. Um, if you search for me on Facebook, it's uh, Somerset Real Air Reviews, uh, Real Air 1977 on YouTube. Um, love it if you you could subscribe. Um, and your reviews, I'd love to answer your reviews. Um, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.